little nervous. I think there's a huge, you know, pressure now that they've started to make cuts. I think that all of us are feeling that. Hi, ladies. We're starting week three of training camp, and we have seven more cuts to make for the final roster. Tonight could be a cut night. We're doing something that we've never done before. We have two choreographers that are going to come in tonight in two totally different genres. One is contemporary slash ballet, and the other is going to be hip hop. So I am not a hip-hop dancer. It's not my forte, but um, all you can do is try your best. I don't like it when somebody says, oh, I, I don't do that. That's not my style. Well, we're looking for performers. I think this will reveal some things. We'll be able to tell the most diverse dancers in the room. We'll be able to tell the smart dancers in the room. So please welcome Brie Hafen. <laughs> Bree is a contemporary ballet-based choreographer. She was on So You Think You Can Dance, and she performed with the Odyssey Dance Theater. I really jive well with the girls. We have a great relationship. I love to teach, and I love working with DCC. Tonight, I'm going to be teaching a kind of funky contemporary. You walk. One, two, three, pop, four, five, six. It's got a little bit of sass to it, a little bit of sultriness to it. Pull, two, three, four. Five. Yeah? And it's very difficult from a stylized perspective. You're gonna run a jam one, two, three. Give me a huge flick. Four, five, six. I think this choreography is so much fun. It's a little different from what we normally do, but it's so much fun to try out some new styles. Four, five, six. And that is it, my loves. Okay, group one. Let's see what you got. I'm gonna give them the opportunity to improv, meaning they get to come up with their own choreography on the spot. For dancers who haven't done a lot of improv, it can be extremely awkward. Oh, oh, watch out! I'm on the floor improving, Alexandria is up improving, and she kind of leaps right over my head. It was fine, we didn't flash, but we almost did. Every second is an audition. You're on stage at all times. Don't hold back. Group two, here we go. I like Savannah on this, Judy. My strategy is definitely to go out there and own it. I want to show them that I'm a strong performer. It means 90% mental, right? Watch Brynn and see if she, if she can breathe. Brennan went for it the best she could do in the improv, but it, it was very uncomfortable to watch. Now Keith Green and his assistant are joining us, and they are going to shake it up a little bit. They're going to be teaching a hip-hop routine. How y'all doing? Anytime I get to work with DCC, it's always a pleasure. Everybody's always so nice and inviting. If you're not a hip-hopper, you are officially going to become one today. Right? Here we go. You're going over. It goes out. From here, boom, to take you in. When I teach, I, I really try to teach at a faster pace. Boom, and cat, cat, boom, hit. And then that allows, you know, Kelly and Judy to kind of see who are those standouts who are able to pick up choreography, like, quicker than the others and retain it as well. Ta, 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 I hit, bam, five, six, bring it, jump, hit, boom. Keith's hip-hop routine really tripped a few of the girls up tonight. Kickball chain, bounce, bounce, hit, go. This choreography is fast. He's teaching it fast. It's very intricate, very detailed, so it's very hard to pick up. Group one. It's going down for it. Linda. They really didn't notice her tonight. She was just one of those dancers that just really didn't stand out as much. It was a little bit disappointing. I just don't know what to think about Madeline. She kind of makes me laugh. Madeline's on the fence for me. She has moments where she's fun, spunky. She also has moments where she's just giving you an average look and show. It's going down for real. 
choreographer's choice in this bunch? Um, you yourself. I'm, I'm not gonna call you Kira. I think Ki Ra is more, <laughs> is more hip hop. <laughs> you have those, those cool moments. So now I think your goal should be to try to manipulate those cool moments all the way through. Next group. Watch Molly. She's pretty bad. She was serious about it. Hater. Yes, she was. <laughs> Throw down the mic. <laughs> Bree, who did you notice with Keith's choreography? Brennan. To me, it just looks like you're thinking too hard. Let yourself go a little bit mentally so it doesn't come off as stress. I have to say this, Brianna. So I kind of heard you uh, are just mainly contemporary, trained, and never really done hip hop. It's, a, it's really cool as a teacher and choreographer to see somebody put themselves in a vulnerable position and really go for it. I really respect that. I really, really do. Yeah, I really do. Yeah. Tonight, I just upped my bucket, and Keith really helped my confidence as well. You can tell you're both passionate about your students, and, and I appreciate that. I know they do, too. Yeah. So thank you. Thanks for having me. All right.